happy Tuesday. Today I wanted to show you guys a little day in my life on a Tuesday because my Tuesdays are my special day. Tuesdays are by far my favorite day of the week because it is my, it's my running day. I usually run five miles. It's, it's literally my favorite thing to do. Currently it is eight. I just got ready for my run but before I can go on my run I always remember to eat breakfast because that's something I'm trying to do before I work out is always eat breakfast because last year I kept not doing that and this year I want to make it a goal to fuel myself for the workout that I'm about to do. So let's go downstairs and grab our breakfast. <laughs> took my vitamins and now i'm just gonna eat my overnight oats with youtube i changed it to a hoodie because my room is literally freezing so i can only imagine outside it's gonna be freezing but i finished my oat now i'm drinking some pre-workout i know ew <laughs> i don't know if you guys know if you have pre-workout you know what i'm about to say i feel like it motivates me more because when i feel it tingling and it, it like hurts i know that i need to push myself more i don't know i don't know what it is guys i I turned into a gym rat or something. So literally why I don't have coffee in the morning anymore. I know that I'm gonna take my pre pressure. Let's go. I will not be showing myself because I look freaking disgusting, but it's protein shake time. I already got my protein mix and I put some greens, chia seed, some spinach, pineapple, some strawberries and blueberries. This is how the smoothie looks like after. I just use the same bottle and put a different lid, but I just always love the color that I get when you use blueberries. Guys, technically, I beat my run time, my speed time, my, I don't know, but yeah, I did that. I'm so happy. Like, I'm excited. Like, I don't know. Yay. <laughs> Well-deserved smoothie. And it tastes delicious. Literally. I didn't put the strawberries. I only put pineapple, blueberries, spinach, the protein powder, and the greens. Guys, I kid you not, I love to check something on the computer and Felix went to go where I was seated. <laughs> for me it's actually gym stuff so this is a gym rat in me i don't think i actually talk about the gym on my channel a lot i just kind of show that i'm there just because i don't really like getting mixed up in that world there's a really good side to it and that's the side that i'm on and then there's a really bad side and that's the side i try to stay the furthest away from i even want to like have a chance to end up on the bad side this is the first one your girl can walk it without ruining her fucking neck because i get a bruise back here but yay got that it comes in this bag i mean this feels pretty good i'm gonna test it out tomorrow i got some little ankle little um wrap so that way i can do the kickback and it also comes in its own little cute bag yay gym stuff i don't know maybe i don't know if you guys would want me to show stuff about the gym i don't know if you guys want me to talk more about it and so that way i can be a better representation of the good side of the gym i don't know you guys let me know because if so then i'll maybe put myself out there so i just made my to-do list and i feel like we have a lot to get done but it's okay this is what i do every weekend I just write down everything I want to get done for the weekend and then I kind of branch off into smaller groups but for like I can have like schoolwork but what entails with that so I put like every assignment that I need to get done this weekend and then I put clean upstairs but cleaning upstairs is so broad so under that I put a little smaller to-do list of what I really need to do like clean bathroom I want to clean my room and that way I have a more clear vision because when I put it so broad it's kind of really like okay so where do I start but having this is exactly knowing, you know, where to start. But right now, I'm finished eating my, my breakfast, which is these overnight oats. And I am just getting prepared to go to the gym. I want to get a quick workout in in the morning. So that way, it kind of kickstarts my day. Hi, we just got out of the gym and I look horrible. I had to leave because I literally felt like I was going to have an anxiety attack. <laughs> and it literally sucks because I don't know why. I don't know what's up with me lately, but I literally just have been so mean to myself. And I've always really struggled with like comparing myself to like, um, I don't know, just to everybody. Like always feeling like I should be doing more. I should be better at something, but I don't know. So I just really, it's probably like the Capricorn moon in me 
but I just really been struggling with that lately and it sucks because I really thought I was over like this stage of my life and I really thought that I was done doing all that stuff like comparing myself really thought I was done with that like part of my life and like I wasn't gonna struggle with that anymore I really thought I healed that but I don't know it's just it's like when you're like so like good then out of nowhere like everything kind of just hits the fan i don't know what it is but, but i mean i went to the gym and i did 12 3 30 i had planned to like do other stuff but it was just so crowded and i just i don't know my anxiety got the best of me it just sucks it just really sucks when you really thought you were over this kind of stage in your life and it's like back and you're just like yeah thank you for listening to that portion i don't even know if it's gonna make the video but if it does, think, good job, Nicole, for being raw. <laughs> We're at Sprouts. <laughs> We're at Sprouts now because um, I want to get some veggies because I ran out of them. Okay, let's just go into Sprouts and if that gives us some serotonin. I need to find serotonin. I don't know how, though. <laughs> groceries I got so I got my regular oatmeal that I always get this is my go-to I just love it overnight oat my thing right now I also got a new chocolate new flavor I'm really excited you know but I feel like it's gonna be pretty good I got blueberry and I got strawberry so my yogurt and I'm trying this cashew milk yogurt one because I love cashew milk if you never tried anything with cashew milk you're kind of sleepy on it cashew milk is the creamiest not oatmeal though I'm excited to try this so yellow and orange peppers and I also got a red onion because I love red onion got some more broccoli and love the squash because we love squash in this house I got a watermelon my mom already ate half I guess I got some cauliflower I'm gonna cut this all up and put it up <laughs> cutting up all the veggies but i made some greek yogurt this is the new one that i have it's the old one yeah i'm just gonna have this as a little snack just did an outdoor meditation with felix it was so nice because i think it's been a year since i've actually meditated i need to start doing this again go back to the roots and the foundations that healed me before today was just a really hard Day. when i was on my walk i was thinking like oh when i get inside i'm gonna do an ab circuit i'm gonna do a pilates circuit i can do all the exercises at home i have an at-home workout i'm just gonna go do that but then i was like nicole like you post about mindfulness and you post about intuitive eating and being intuitive and being connected with your body yet you're not showing yourself that same grace my body clearly was telling me that it's it was tired i overworked it i just was in a really bad spot i burnt myself out so bad and that's why i'm like this i need to incorporate this again back into my life take it a moment of rest and i really didn't realize the damage i was doing to my body but you know once you hit rock bottom good thing about that is that you can only go up and that's what i'm happy about the fact that i'm able to recognize recognize this at such an early stage that i can still reverse the damage that i've been doing thank you guys for listening to my little post meditation rant it's been really nice just going out really enjoying this moment outside with nature and reconnecting and literally grounding myself again thank you guys for listening to that me and felix are just gonna walk home and i'm gonna listen to pod <laughs> shower since i've been like sad all day and feeling that way all day my head started hurting and i was like laying in bed and after i got out of my shower but then i was like you know what i'm not gonna wallow i'm not gonna be sad i'm gonna treat myself i feel like when we say that we're like okay so if we're gonna treat ourselves we're gonna go out we're gonna spend money and everything like that but no i'm going to try to make this like a self-care night for me and do like cute little small like acts of love towards myself because i was like laying down and next to my bed i seen like i 
have a picture of my my younger self and i was just looking at her like that's me you know that's still me and i'm still her and i need to treat her with kindness because she's not just gone she's still living through me and i don't know why i'm being so mean to her let's first braid our hair okay now that's more like it but i had planned on doing this face mask it's a detoxifying clay mask and it literally pulls out everything from your skin it's crazy but i do have this sephora sample that i once got yeah i want to do this one okay first we're gonna take out our nose piercing i took that out really fast and easy that kind of hurt <laughs> Because I'm gonna slow down, I'm gonna be outside of my head while I make it. Okay, very different changes of plans. I'm gonna make oat milk. Of course, we're gonna use our blender. We're gonna use this as a nut bag because I feel like a lot of times the reason why we don't make it is because we don't have a nut bag and we don't want to order one, but this literally works as one. And then we have, of course, our rolled oats. I'm gonna use vanilla extract and my sweetener. <laughs> honest there's definitely room for improvement i think i needed coconut oil so it could be like thicker you know for somebody who just didn't whipping it up who cares let's put it into a mason jar and see how it goes using it the whole entire week i didn't show you guys what i made <laughs> it's mixed up already but i got chicken and i used this like sesame bean i just have cauliflower and green beans and broccoli and i just made a bowl mm -hmm. 